What's going on guys, Daniel Kump here with you and we're talking about my Econ and Income Shift Pro and a very, very, very cool thing that I wanna share with you today and how, plain and simple, how you're gonna be a better marketer and how you're going to split test your Income Shift Pro capture pages. If you haven't seen it yet, when you click on the link and I'm gonna show you that guys that in a second, there's 15 different capture pages that are available with Income Shift Pro. So if we're driving traffic and we wanna to start to figure out what pages convert well with a particular traffic vendor, and guys, trust me, um, anytime you try a different traffic vendor, whether it be a solo ad vendor or pay-per-click or anything like that, you're gonna get different results. Different pages are gonna get different results from different vendors. As they say, uh, different strokes for different folks, right? So same exact principles apply here. Now, what we're gonna need is a tool, an online tool called Click Magic. So if you don't have Click Magic, um, you can either A, stop this video, or B, uh, you can get Click Magic if you wanna learn some of these cool things that we're gonna show you. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you kind of a, a, a backdoor trick how to create a, a rotator and a split test with Click Magic so we can use that with Income Shift Pro. Now, realize this is that there is a rotator inside of Income Shift Pro, but that is just for you and sharing with your leads, okay? So make sure that you follow along and pay close attention here, okay? So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go in and we're gonna look at the capture pages for Income Shift Pro, okay? so. Literally just go here, hit select another page. And as you guys can see, uh, we're in here. Now, I realize this cool little trick is that, we'll go back out to the homepage just for a second. You can see that with the capture page URL right here, okay, the capture page URL. When you look at it, it looks like just an umbrella page. Umbrella meaning that it's one link. It's just one link, incomeshiftpro.com forward slash your username. And that's gonna take you to the capture page that you have selected here on this home screen right here. But a lot of people might not know this is there is an individual link for each of your capture pages. Let me show you how to get that. So we're gonna go back in here. And all you gotta do is go to any of these capture pages. Now, I'm on a Mac, a MacBook Pro. I'm sure if you guys are on a PC or something like that, you guys are gonna be able to right click. And for me, what I wanna be able to do is I wanna split test the different capture pages that don't have the phone number. I'm specifically looking at ones that just have name and email. So I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five of these guys right here. There's another one there, but we're only gonna select a few of those because um, I don't wanna be splitting too many pages at one time. So in order to get that link, all you gotta do is hold your cursor over the page itself, okay? and then right click and copy link address. So if I were to come up here and I would have paste the link in there, boom, you guys can see now there's a different capture page address than the one that we just had, right? So yes, I realize that what I'm talking about now is a little more advanced, but if you just kind of follow along with what I'm doing, I'm gonna show you guys this and trust me, split testing is one of the best things that you can do when running traffic, because plain and simple, you're gonna find out what works and what doesn't, and it's very important for you to know that information. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into Click Magic, all right, and we're going to set up some split testing. So this is the back office of Click Magic. As you can see, I, I split test a lot of different things. I run traffic to a lot of different things, and I like to track my information. It's a very smart thing to do. So to set this up, guys, you're just gonna go here, create new link, okay? Now you can name this ultimately whatever you want. I'm just gonna put my econ test link okay come down here same thing my econ test link call it whatever you want that's what we're calling it so primary url this is the capture page link that we just right clicked to get so you can see right there capture page 47 don't need to change anything else so link name tracking link name and then paste your copy capture page just as you got it from income shift pro then we're just going to hit create link Okay, wait for that to load and then boom. So as we can see, my econ test link. So now we have that set up. Now what we're gonna wanna do, so in other words, if anyone were to click on our tracking link, which is this link right here, if anyone were to click on that, it's going to automatically go to that capture page, okay? It's gonna go to this capture page right here. 
But now what I want to do is I want to add more capture pages. I'm going to create a split test or a rotator, okay? So next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab another capture page that I want to use, okay? So let's say I'm going to grab this one right here. Right click, copy the link address. I'm going to come back to Click Magic, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to this little gear right here, and then I'm going to go to this thing called split testing because that's what I want to do. I want to split test. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste the URL right here. Okay, boom. And see how right here where it says CP43, I'm just going to call this capture page 43. Okay. Again, you guys can na you can name it whatever you want. If you want to name it, uh, you know, if we were to go back here, if you want to name it uh, smiling girl with glasses, girl with glasses, although you got a girl with glasses right there, but um, you know, smiling girl, whatever you want to call it, you can call it CP43. And then all we're going to do is I'm going to leave this. I'm just going to put this at zero for now. We're going to, we're going to fix this in a minute, but I'm just going to put it at zero for now and I'm going to hit add URL. So now I have two links, which means that anytime someone goes to this link, there's two different links that they can go to. And we're going to fix that wait in a minute. Now what I want to do is I want to add a few more pages that I'm going to split test. Okay. So I'm going to come back here. Let's grab this one here. Now, ultimately guys, the pages that we're going to split test, I want you to look at all 15 pages and realistically, you're going to identify pages that you feel are good pages in your eyes that you say, all right, I like this page. It's attractive. It's whatever it is. I like the image. I like how simple it is. Whatever you want to pick two, three, four, I don't you know, 10 pages that you want to split test. But for the purpose, I just want to show you guys a few and then how you're going to run traffic to that. Okay. So like I said, now, again, we're going to split test this page here. I'm going to get that link. I'm going to come back to click magic. I'm going to add in another page. So I'm going to paste my link in and this is capture page 42. So I'm just going to call this CP 42. All right. That's going to go to zero. I'm going to hit add. Okay. Boom. And now what we're going to do, we'll just go grab one more link. Let's say we're going to use this page right here. Copy that. Again, hold your cursor over, right click, copy link address. Come back to Click Magic. And here, paste in my link, CP44, capture page 44. Okay. Set it to zero, add URL. All right. So now I have four different pages that I'm going to test. I got four different pages that I'm going to run traffic to. Now what I want to do is I want to equalize all these weights. I want them all to be the same. So I'm just going to click this little cool button that says equalize weights. All right. And then boom, they're all nice and equal 25%. So now what that means is what happens is when I click here to get my link, this right here, guys, this right here is the link that you're going to use when you start driving traffic. So driving traffic, meaning if you want to do that through social media, if you're going to do that through YouTube, Facebook ads, solo ads, Bing, pay-per-click, whenever, if you go and you purchase traffic, you go get paid traffic and you're working with a solo ad vendor or you're working with uh, pay-per-click or whatever it is, that tracking link right there, the one that's literally right behind this video, I'll even kind of move this, this tracking link right above me here, that's the link that you're going to give to your vendor. That's the tracking link that you're going to give to your vendor. Okay. So that's kind of the first phase. So now let's say traffic starts running, traffic starts coming in and starts going to those four different capture pages. Now you can add more, you can take them away, whatever. Now what we want to do is see how they're performing. You want to know how the capture pages are performing. So now we're going to go back to income shift pro and we're going to go check out some stats. Now, obviously I don't have any traffic driving to that because we just set it up. However, if you want to see that, you're going to go in your toolbox. Then you're going to come over here to stats. We're going to launch that. And what we're going to look at is we're going to look at page views right here. We're going to look at page views. So up at the top where it says overview, we're going to look at page views. Okay. This is going to show you, this is really cool. This is going to show you with all your different capture pages right here, see all the different capture pages right there, this is gonna show you your opt-ins and then your ratio, which is, your ratio is just your opt-in percent, okay? So plain and simple, for every 
eight people that hit that page, three of them opted in, giving us a 37.5 opt-in rate. So once your traffic gets going, let's say you're you're running for round numbers a thousand clicks, you're gonna have roughly, okay, roughly 250 clicks go to each of those four pages that we just created. And you're gonna be able to come here into your back office and you're gonna look at the opt-in rate and say, okay, um, you know, capture page 44 performed decent, 42, I didn't like it all, 43 was so-so. So why this is important is next time you go run traffic, if you go run it with that same vendor, you're gonna know which page converts better and you're gonna maybe wanna give them one page or just two pages instead of all four, all right? So really, really cool little tick, uh, trip guy, <laughs> technique, can't talk today. Really cool little technique to make sure that you're split testing, make sure that you're split testing your Income Shift Pro capture pages with traffic so you know what converts and what doesn't with what vendor. Now, what's great is you can give that link to multiple different vendors and you're gonna just be able to track over um, time. What's cool about this is right above this video, you can see where you can track by, right up here, track by dates. So if you have a traffic run going one week and a traffic run going another week, you're gonna be able to track, uh, see you know different times throughout the week or different weeks what pages are converting and what are not. So really cool tip, really cool feature, guys. If you have any questions, get back to the person that shared this video with you or if you're in uh, our my, my Econ group, you can just ask it there in the group chat box because uh, we're there to support you. We're there to help you guys win. So I'll see you guys on the next video. Hopefully you guys got some value out of this, but please do yourself a favor, split test your capture pages so you know what works. It's just gonna make you a better marketer and you're gonna get better results in the long run. I'll see you on the next video. Bye.